Iron armor, of all the Kung Fu techniques, is the most mysterious. With it, one can stand blows from swords and stabbings from spears. One is invulnerable. In fact, it involves strenuous breath control, and of all techniques, it's the most difficult. The human body has 108 pressure points. 36 of these can be fatal, the remainder paralyzing. To learn iron armor, one starts with the breathing. For controlling the pressure of one's breath, there are eight methods. When one has mastered all these, the air circulation at any point within the whole of the body. Then the body is completely protected and thus invulnerable. However, though, there must always remain the breath gate, one unprotected point. The Eagle Claw was devised by Yu Fei. It has 108 patterns. These were developed from 50 basic attacks. This fighting style concentrates on the bones, sinews, muscles, and the more fragile joints. All of the technique's power lies in the fingertips. The touch must be at once gentle and yet like an iron vice. The tactics in the Eagle Claw is to wait until the antagonist pauses. At that point, he will change his breath control. And that's when the Eagle Claw strikes. That's what he's waiting for. The Eagle Claw is the deadliest of all techniques. Let's get that sword. 
My name's Chao Lu Fong. I've been here eight years, but I haven't seen anyone fight as well as you. May I please ask your name, sir? My name's Hu. It's Hu Long. Oh, pleased to meet you. Well, what's going on here, then? Oh. What's wrong? General Chao. Didn't recognize you. Sorry. Sorry. Let's go. Stop! Right. Right. General, I'm just a peasant. <laughs> I doubt that. I've seen how good your techniques are. You're a kung fu expert, and peasants don't become experts. You have my respect, good sir. Now, there is one favor I would like to ask you. If you would be kind enough to let me examine that fine sword. Sure. General Chow, please. First class. First class. It is a fine sword. Too good for its owner. Well, General Chow, thanks for your time. I must go. Goodbye. Now, please wait. I'm the examination officer for Mr. Lu. I recruit his assistants. No, yeah, Mr. Lu? Is that the Mr. Lu who once defeated the Japanese? That's him. Right now, he's most worried about the Ming government. And that's why he's asked me to recruit some suitable warriors. And you, with all your skills, you seem just right. Exactly what I'm looking for. Thank you, thank you. All right. Now let's drink. To the Mings. Drink up. To them. Please meet Mr. Lu. It's a great... <laughs> I'm flattered, flattered. Get up. My lord. Oh, this Ming ceremonial. It's one of our failings. Mr. Hu is the man I told you of. Oh? Hmm. Oh. Hmm. Good. Very good. I'm not as fast as I was, so I can't guard the king properly, and I need help. Oh. Oh. Tell me, which is your sect? Well, in fact, it's very similar to you, Mr. Liu. Hmm? How do you know that? The style that you use is one of the 32 of the main Sung styles. 
a classic technique. The same style I've been studying too, since I was six, so that's how I knew it. Oh? Uh, but the style that you used was not one of the 32 song styles. Out of deference to you, I used the scene sex style. It's gentler. Hmm. You're better than I. Uh, well, tell me then, which of these various styles do you think is the best then, huh? I'd rather not answer that, if you don't mind. But he has asked you. I think you ought to reply. Uh, all of the styles have their drawbacks. None's perfect. The Lu Jiang strike technique is weak in its defenses. And Li Ban's kicking style cannot match the eagle claw. And so the best idea is to combine the best of all styles. Knit them together so their strands cancel out all our weaknesses. That way, an all-round <laughs> is quite possible. Uh, you're right. Uh, and I must test your skill now. Come, out to the courtyard and let us practice. Of course. Misjudge that one. Come on. Assassin! Mr. Luke. Mr. Luke! Oh, He's gone. Where? Get after him. Well, go on. Don't just stand there. Shut up. Mr. Lu treated you so well, and you repay his kindness by killing him. Take this man. Sir! Sir. General Way, you're wrong. No. Am I? Take him to the court. Sir. No. Go on. Come on. I have the minister's orders to deal with this man. And why? This man has assassinated Mr. Liu. And for that crime, he must die. Ancestors, I've been convicted for killing a man, and I should die. But the real killer has fled, and I have to catch him. Help me to capture Ho Long, and to avenge my master. Hot! <laughs> 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 
Take these two men. They betrayed their trust. Behead them. Sir. Sir. Uh, please, uh, please, my lord. Spare, 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 spare us. Spare us. Take them. Come on. Come on. Spare us, my lord. Come on. Please. Have mercy. Spare us. Spare us, spare us. Spare us. Oh, my lord. Please. Oh. It's clear that General Chow murdered Mr. Liu. The Minister for Royal Security. He must be caught. From all the provinces, General Chow must be apprehended and be killed at once. And those who help him must be killed. Call Shen Yu here. Well now, Shen Yu, you any idea where Chow may hide? My lord, he may have been bribed by the rebels or by the Japs to try and destroy state security. In that case, he'll either have gone to the Japs in Qingzhou or to the rebels in Taihu. The country, when all the wanted notices are sent out, won't be easy. To all provincial and city authorities, the traitor, General Chow, with the help of a Kunlun pugilist, Hulun, have killed Minister Lu. They may make for Kunlun as a last resort, and by now are probably in the Dabo Mountains. There's some men that I hate the most. Rebels, turncoats, traitors. See this? It was a gift from the king to me, for being a good minister of state. So. Oh. If I don't catch Chow, I'm disgraced, and I must resign. How can I help? Please instruct me. You are the most expert fighter in my whole department. Only you can cope with General Chow's Kung Fu. So then, I want you to bring me that traitor's head. I'll see that you're very well rewarded and promoted. I need no... Please get up. My lord, I have been tattooed with Mr. Lu's own motto, loyalty. And he was to me like a father. I shall catch that killer for his sake, not for any reward. Well said. I admire your spirit. Now then, remember what I said? General Chow must be killed. Your horse will be ready at dawn. No, I leave tonight. Yes? Coming. Ditching! Hey, what are you doing? Fussing in like this? Ditching! Hey! Ditching! Hey, you see that man there? He just burst in the door. Throw huh? him out. It's General Chow. Kneel down and apologize to him. Uh-huh. If the general hadn't intervened on my behalf once, I wouldn't be allowed to you. It's all right. Please, get up. Tell me, have you seen a Kong Lun fighter passing through here in these last few days? Oh, I guess that you must mean Hu Long. Hmm. <laughs> he has been away, up in the capital. But I heard some Kung Lung people say that any day he'll arrive back. Huh? General, the soldiers are hunting for you. Come in and rest.
Uh, uh, Listen, Ho Lung is the killer, and not me. Uh, 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 I don't want to kill you, but I will if you make me. <laughs> well, now, my friends, I'll drink to you. Yeah, I'll drink to that. <laughs> Listen, don't forget us, and they make you an official in the city. <laughs> <laughs> don't worry. When that General Chow is killed, I'll be a very rich man. <laughs> hey, listen. You were telling me that General Charles to me? Right. He's coming here. But don't you worry. We've set a nice ambush for him. There's an inn that's run by some good friends of ours. And they've prepared a warm welcome for the general. And so we just sit here and wait for the news of his death. Wait up! Hey, over here, waiter. Check. Waiter. All right. Coming! Coming, sir. Over here. Good day, sir. Just stand, just stand, sir. Yes. <laughs> hey, doctor. Those needles. What can they keep? Uh, sorry. I think it's a bit deaf. <laughs> oh. Is that so? Listen. Do you think you can cure me? <laughs> of course. I'd be pleased to help you relax. All this traveling makes you too tired. You're right there. See what you can do. All right, I'll try. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Uh, thank you. Thank uh -huh. you. Right. Cut it off. Wait a minute. Sorry, the wrong size needles. I made a vow not to kill, but it seems I must. fight real well. But let's see if you can beat me now, though. Die. Tell me, where is Ho Long? Uh, he, he, he's gone to Kun Lung. <laughs> Who's there?
Taking you back to the court. Tao Lu Fong, you really are a killer. Back off. Who are you? Your executioner. I'm from the ministry. Uh, so you're with the same gang. That's why you let him go. Who was he? You saved him, so don't pretend. He's the one that you hired to kill Mr. Lou. Who are you? Or are you ashamed of your name? Huh. Well, like I said, I'm your executioner sent by the ministry. Shen Yu. Heard of you. But never thought the famous Shen Yu would be a cheap killer. Hmm. It seems that besides being a killer, our General Chow is a slanderer, too. You and Ho Long to kill Mr. Lu. And now me. So nobody knows your secret. Stop pretending. It won't help you. <laughs> He's in my custody. Sorry, you can't have him. Who says so? And you, let me have him. I warn you, don't try to interfere, or I may have to hurt you. Huh. Well, we'll see. And we haven't had a single word from Shen Yu. My lord, Shen Yu's used to working alone. And I... So Chow was framed. Do you think the rumors could be true? Don't think so. All the evidence was there. He's guilty. And there's no smoke? Without fire. Go to Kunlun to investigate. Sir. Teacher. Teacher? I've disowned you. Teacher, I beg you, help me. You've been expelled from the sect. Nobody knows you. Teacher, you have to help me. Teacher, you must. But nobody else can beat him. Hmm? Who's this? Cholufong. 
I already saved you once, then. Huh? You did? <laughs> it seems more than one man is after you. Uh huh? I help you? I'd like some water. Ah, come in. Right, here you are. Thank you. Mm. You sick? Just a twinge. It's nothing. Ah. Do you live alone here? Oh. I live here with my sister. She's gone shopping. I'll go then. Is your sister at home? Uh, no, she's still in town. Still in town? I hope you're not lying to me. Now listen, I'm intending to marry your sister today. And your family should consider itself honored by that. Huh. Well, that's entirely up to my sister. <laughs> right. We'll be back later. <laughs> sister! <laughs> See, now, I nearly missed you. I'm taking you to get married. Daku, the fact that your family's so rich means nothing to me. So get out of here. <laughs> you hear that? Shilon isn't interested in my generous offer. <laughs> hey, you. You can't take her unless you can knock me down with ten blows. Sisu. <laughs> Denna, I don't think you can even stand one. If you can't do it, then you have to leave her alone. Right. But if you get hurt, then don't blame me. Right. Brother. Come on. Now you can go home. Very good. But still, you ought to know by now that I never keep any of my promises to anybody. Take her! Hold it! Who are you? I've never met garbage like you in all of my life. That's all right. My pleasure. My name's Chow. Oh, Mr. Chow, you fight well. You fight well, too. That technique, it's iron armor. Right, my granddad. <gasps> Shh. He just talks nonsense. 
I must go. Now wait. Why not stay here for a few days? His men will come back again. Sister, Mr. Chow's sick. He was taking herbs. Huh? Mr. Chow, if you'd like to stay here, we'd be delighted to have you. Excuse me. Mr. Chow, please stay here. Tell me who your grandfather is, and I'll stay. Uh, uh, but you'll keep it a secret. Mm -hmm. His name's Si Tin Kung. Oh? He's one of the three pupils of Iron Armor Shen, who's known as the Iron Gentleman. That's him. Pity he was killed. Still a mystery how he was killed. His killer was never found. Hey, listen. You teach me, and I'll teach you. <laughs> teacher. Teacher, uh, sit down. you to kill Mr. Liu. Teacher, I didn't say. I made a vow. If I tell you, I'll be killed. You don't have to speak. I've written two names on my palms. Look at them. Don't speak. If it's right, well then, you look into my eyes. So it was him. Brother, you're really too ambitious. My God. Oh, Lung, I have to leave now. But you stay here. Don't go out. Or else you're dead for sure. It's great. Take a rest. Yeah. Remember, it's the spirit that matters, and not just the skill. Mm. When I grow up to be a man, I'd like to be upright like you. Good. You be upright. There was a saying in my village, you must sing to keep out sorrows, walk each road to keep them clear. Sharpen swords to keep off rust. Stand upright to stay a man. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> hey.
Hey, last night, you told us the story of a man who was wrong. Sister said the man was you. She's a smart girl. She thinks that you're a good man. That's why she taught me to teach you iron finger. Iron finger? Hmm, the one technique that can combat the iron armor. My sister said we'll teach you how to use it. Oh? Really? All right, let's start. Let's see the Lee Hu sword. <laughs> right. Oh, well now, folks, we hope you've enjoyed our little entertainment. Now then, that monkey isn't young. He's 40 years old now. Oh. All these years, he's been traveling around with me. You see, he takes herb wine. This wine will keep him young. Or torn muscles. Or rheumatism. Yes, folks, this wine can... Anyone like to... Hey! This bruise was made by my wife's fist. You see? Wife's fist? Yeah. I don't believe that. Well, you're right. It was a real mean fist. Well, it wasn't all that mean. Because whoever made that bruise could easily have killed you. You see, whoever struck that particular blow was a real expert. In that case, count yourself lucky. Damn you! You just try to make excuses, your wine doesn't work. Who says it doesn't? <gasps> well then? It's gone. <laughs> well, it seems your wine isn't bad stuff, huh? Right. All right. Pay for the wine. You. Mr. Shen, you have a job. Why waste your time here? Tell me. Why are you here? Minister's idea. As you don't know this place, he sent me to help you. He's wrong. I know this place. So go back. I've orders. Hmm. So I'll stay. I'll be on my way.
I hope that they paid you well. Sister, there's a man looking for Chow. Huh? Ask him in. Right. Uh, it's my sister. Hmm. Do sit down. I'll make tea. Chow here? Uh, I think he'll be back real soon, though. Sit down. Have some tea. Thanks. Are you a friend of Chow's? No. You? A relative? Oh, oh no. But some men insulted my sister once. Mr. Chow was passing by and helped us. Hmm? Mr. Chow... T the style he uses. He said rebels are bad, and that the security minister, Mr. Liu, was murdered by a rebel. Which one? Hu Lung. He said he's a vicious killer. Right now he's hunting for him. Oh, Mr. Chow, your friend's here. You. Huh, you found a good place. Let's talk outside. Over there. Go a bit further. In case we fight. That kid there mustn't see. And where's Hu Long now? Both of you are coming with me. If you've got him, I'll be a witness. Because he's the murderer. You come with me. I have to see. For their sake, I won't cuff you. But I warn you, try anything and you'll be dead. Mm. Out of the out. I've got you. Huh? Why are you here? I want this man. There's a reward for him. Well, if you want, you cuff me. Huh? Mr. Joe! Mr. Joe! Huh? Uh, you forgot these. Thanks. But I shall be back. Take a rest. Like a drink? What is this? I want his head. It's easier to carry. Step aside. Oh, no. He'll be questioned. And dead, he can't talk. You're disobeying orders. You were told to kill him. Why don't you? 
I don't care about orders. I came here to avenge my old teacher and not for the court. You dare do this? I'll kill you, you traitor! No, wait. Wait. Let him. That sword of his can't harm me. <laughs> it can't, eh? Want to test it? Try ten strokes. You make it, then I'm dead. Reward with him. You fail, then I go. Damn you! The fifth. It's the ninth. You only got one more chance left. And then I leave you. <laughs> Goodbye. Hold it. You're not going anywhere. Just give me three days, and if I'm still alive, I shall come back here with whole long. That's a promise. Right. I trust you. Three days. Give my word. The iron finger was designed to combat iron armor. The whole body's strength is concentrated in the fingertips. It's used to attack the pressure points and disturb the breath control, after which the opponent is virtually helpless. By itself, it doesn't actually break iron armor, but it can sense out the weak point in the armor and show where to attack. Oh, you're back, sir. Wake me early in the morning. Yes, sir. A great irony. Boiled beans with beanstalk. <laughs> See. Ada. Uh, there. You're back. Been working so late? <laughs> well, now, I must earn my pay, no matter how late the hour. That's why the hermit Tao refused to become an official. Rather, 
I'm so tired of all these official duties, and I've made up my mind to retire at last. But I don't think you can, at least not at the moment. You've a case to solve yet. Mr. Lou's murder. Well, I've ordered the officials of all the provinces to catch Chao Lu Fong. You really think he's the killer? Brother, I sincerely hope you won't be careless. The true killer will have a teacher who will support him. Why should you get yourself involved? Well, I don't think. That is to beat me. You can't say. Time can change all conditions. And you may not always be so lucky. <laughs> I think. In your place, I'd play safe and try to arrange some deal. Hmm. Well then, what would you like? I think I'd like to become a general. <laughs> That's no problem. That's very quickly arranged. But still, have you forgotten what our teacher said? Nothing in this world is completely free. Ah, uh, well, that's easily solved. You can meet me tomorrow morning at 11 o'clock, and I'll give you Ho Lung. Ho Lung? He's up in Kunlun. Well, I know exactly where Ho Lung is. And when I leave here, I shall go directly to him. Don't you worry. I'll deliver him. Rely on me. Teacher. How dare you disobey and leave my place? I'm very sorry. Very bad news. My mother's very sick. Uh, and I knew that if you'd have been there, you would have let me go see her. And that's the reason that I left. Just the same. Always got an excuse. Teacher, how come that you're here? For your sake. My sake? Well, tomorrow, the Minister of State's coming for you. Huh? Teacher, teacher, save me! <laughs> the two of us were both pupils of Iron Armor Shen. But he was too good, and I could never beat him. And now, he has a new skill. He's mastered the Eagle Claw. <laughs> Idiot. I think you can run too. He'll track you down. Well then, I'll kill him. You fool you. Cheng has always remained celibate. So that his iron armor is doubly strong now. Nothing can break it. You with your skill wouldn't last five minutes. Well then, it seems I must die. But I know where his weak spot's located. What's that? In his throat. The only place where he can be hurt. You'll pretend to be tied up to the posts, hide your daggers, wait your chance, and then you plunge them into his boat. I don't get it. Why the minister should want to murder Mr. Lu? Because the minister's ambitious. The king's too weak. And Cheng wants to get rid of him, then make himself king and rule the country. But he had to fix Lu first. Soil. Lu had kept the dynasty alive, and he had a great deal of power. But Lu is dead, so why doesn't Cheng kill the king? He's a very careful man, though. He has to make sure that you won't talk. Once he's rid of you, he'll move then 
I guarantee it. You're the stumbling block, and tomorrow he'll take care of that. Mister! <laughs> Hold on. I didn't tie you up. It was your teacher. Your lordship, please spare me. <laughs> Sorry. You have to die. You know too many secrets. My lord, when you asked me to kill Lou, you said you'd reward me. You said you'd give me wealth and honor. <laughs> so I did. But I was lying. But still, though, when your own teacher betrays you, what can you expect? Tell me what. Damn you. You bastard! <laughs> well, I suppose I am. But now I shall do you a favor. I shall strike you once with the greatest accuracy. The thing. Just what I expected. But still, my one weak spot isn't throat anymore. It took me ten full years to achieve the transposition. But now nobody can know where my weak spot is. Maybe, maybe not. I'll have thirty passes at you and I'll know where it is. What makes you think you'll live that long? to expose your plot to Chow, but now he knows. <laughs> Brother, we've fought our battle through 50 years. And since the very first day that we met, you've never beaten me even once. You liar. Hypocrite. You're a sham. You never really became a hermit. You're envious. I know. You want to be the master of Eagle Claw, instead of me. That's why you want to see me dead. Why? 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 Oh! 
You're a fool. Can't beat me. You are wrong. My weak spot isn't there. So you came. It's all right. We'll guard you. Who are you? The gang of three. I'm the leader. You go home. <gasps> Hold it. You have to meet me first.
The whole gang, all three of you, are here. Brother, mm. I think I'll take him first. Oh, no, usual way. Right? Ten, four, eight, six, three, two, one, one three, five, four, eleven, one. Right, three, I'll take you all. Five, what? Huh? You'll take us both? But that's too easy. It won't last long. Right. Right, <laughs> seven, go. Right, two. No, that's it. I won. Your three days are up now. I know. I shall go along with you. Who are you then? And why are you fighting with us? You three men. You've gone too far. I'll deal with you. Thanks. Well now, I guess we'd better go. Right. But still, besides you, there's another man I must get. Who? The man that you accuse, Hu Long. Really? I have to find out the truth. Where is Hu now? You go home. He's gone home. Where's that? It can't be far. Let's check around. Right. Ma! 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 I'm back! Ma! Who? Who's it's that? me! I'm back! Oh. oh, my boy, you came back. Sure, I'm here. Oh. 
<laughs> My boy. Ma, I brought you some of your favorite cakes. Here you are. They're good. With peaches. Oh, good. Good. Ma, I have some good news. I'm going to be very rich. I know that. You know it. Your friend has told me. My friend? Yeah. You're needed at the court now. You better come. <laughs> Don't let her hear. Right. We'll discuss things on the way. Oh, soon. <laughs> Ma, I'll be right back. You can choose your place. You, you really have to kill me? You're dead now. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it was a gift from the king to me. Dead. That's the end. No hope for me. Put on the cuffs. Tell me, if I were to kill you, could you blame me? You freed me. Saved my life. I couldn't prove my innocence to you. It's my fate. I wouldn't blame you. Well then, is there anything that you want to say? I don't care whether I live or I die. But I care about the man behind all this. I hope you can find him. You any idea who it might be? I have no idea. But he has to be caught. Go now. What? I can go? Far as possible. But why? You stay here, and you'll be killed. So go, and quickly. But if I could get to the court, perhaps I could clear myself. Huh, you wouldn't live that long. How will you explain yourself? My business. Off you go. Gentlemen, can't do that. It isn't correct. Well, I don't give a damn about that. Just get going. 
I've got no time to argue with you. Either go, or I'll execute you now. Now you saved my life twice. I won't forget. And we'll meet again. Goodbye. Why are you here? Hmm. <laughs> he, he knew that you'd probably take this shortcut. He's here? He's waiting for you back there. Oh. Please. Your Lordship. <laughs> well, I heard that you had managed to arrest Chao Lu Fong. Thought I'd meet you. That's right, I did manage to catch him. I let him go. Oh? But why? I discovered who the killer is. Uh, I think that you know. <laughs> Good. You're an extremely astute fellow. We can stop pretending. And who are they? They are my personal guards. They're very interested in your skill, too. And so they'd like to test you. So go ahead and prove yourself, then. I'm sure you'll find it very stimulating. Go on, and I'll watch you. Oh, 
You really are very skillful, and in particular with the Yang Spear. First class, first class. I had to kill them to defend myself. I'm very sorry. No need for that. The winner is never at fault. Shen Yun, now you can try me. <laughs> Seems like another contestant. It seems that the two of us are all that's left. So, friend, what's on your mind, then? Huh. The jade that the king gave you. Mind if I see it? Hmm. Oh, I don't have it. It's at home. Huh. Is it? Then what is this? It seems you know the truth. Well, I'm sure we can reach an agreement. You follow me, and I will make you rich beyond your wildest dreams. My God! You're quite amazing. You think everyone's like you. You're wrong. I wouldn't touch your damn money. It would make me sick. <laughs> the Mings are finished. There's no point in resisting the change. Well, I was born a Ming. That way. And I'll always fight traitors like you. All right. And I've no choice. I'll have to kill you. I guess you know what my technique is. Huh, you're the Eagle Claw Master. Oh, and something else. I'm also the master of the Iron Armor. Thank <laughs> you. 
You saved my life, remember? And I can't just walk away and leave you to all this. <laughs> Chao Lufong, <laughs> you're here at last. I've been waiting a very long time for this. All right, you can try my technique too. Watch for the eagle claw. the iron finger to match your iron armor. You didn't know that? Where did you learn it? Well, that's my business, not yours. I realize I still can't break through your armor, but I can find your weak spot, and I will. But there's 108 possibilities, so it won't be that simple. But of the 108, only 36 count, and you've reduced those to five, and I would guess with you. It's the head, temple, throat, armpits, groin. One of those. Right. Just you try it. On the forehead of the temple. <sighs> and it's not the throat. Yeah. 
It's not that. a weak spot. You lie. There must be one. <laughs> Brother Chow, attack the grind. who knows that technique. Relatives of a man you once killed, Chi Tin Kuang. Huh? My granddad. And now we shall avenge him. We've waited long enough. Hey. 